my name is Stanislaw Robert Liberto with AV Ultra with a quick tip on After Effects and Cinema 4D. There's a little trick to working with Cinema 4D and After Effects. If I want to just start Cinema 4D, I can't go into my applications and open it. It won't let you do that. If I'm in After Effects and I just make myself a new comp here, I'm going to go up to my File, New, and there's a button right here, Maxon Cinema 4D File. And what that's going to do is ask you what you want to name your file. I'm just going to call it Untitled right now. And it's going to launch a copy of Cinema 4D. Now I have Cinema 4D full version installed on my machine, which that's what's going to load on mine. But the differences, if you're getting started with 3D, are pretty negligible. You should totally be able to get along great with just the light version. Once that gets going, it'll open up. You might get a, a window asking you to register. But otherwise, you can just start creating stuff right in Cinema 4D. And the beauty about this is if I make something, let's make some text here. I'll just call this 3D text. And I'm going to go ahead and shrink that down just a wee little bit here. And we're going to go ahead and extrude that too. So we'll just go ahead and drop that text right in the extrusion. And let's uh, throw on some nice white material here. And we'll just put this box right behind this text. And then we'll make a plane here too. I'm just going to scale this up. And let's throw in just a couple more shapes here really quick. Just a sphere. I'm just going to go ahead and add a quick light. And I'm going to save that. And here's what happens. If I'm back in After Effects and I drag this guy right into my comp, there is my full 3D in After Effects. And now that it's in After Effects, I can do lots of other things to it too. We can add a little bit of a glow to everything. And I can very quickly and very easily start working with Cinema 4D. Again, my name is Stanislaw Robert Liberto with AV Ultra. Hopefully you found this tutorial useful.